Yeah, yeah. Like, I yeah. really don't know how much these, like, I mean, obviously, Chew's been a household name for a while, but it's like, you know, I mean, you have two top ten foxes, essentially, like, playing. Like, of course they're going to do well. I don't know how, like, what they know about teams. It does feel like you can almost put any combination of very good foxes together. And they will do fine. They're right? instantly a threat. Like, Crush with almost anybody. It yeah, like. it's like Crush KGH was a threat. KGH hates teams. <laughs> he you really know, does like, not like it. Yeah. So I guess this is what happened. They're, they're oh, two yeah. wanting the ICs in. Wes is just shooting. Uh, he's shooting at least though, which both surprises me and makes me happy. Like, yeah. That's the Wes I want to see. I um, like it. But like, if you look at the damages, Port Three, who I don't know which box it is, but they've only taken two percent. So like, so it's like Wes can break it up with the lasers, but he's not. It's not a good position still. Yeah, it's yeah. just mitigating damage. He's just made, and it's like as long as you know. Oh wait. Okay. Well, oh, that could have been down air, maybe. Dude. Okay, so I don't actually know the rules about doubles wobbling. Uh, I, think, I mean, it's legal in singles it's, it's, And it's legal in singles here. So which, then it has to be legal in doubles, but... Right. Unless they did something really weird. But, like, generally, I don't even... Like, yeah, now generally, that I, I don't know. It. Yeah. I think generally if it's banned in singles, it's in doubles. Most people would agree. But, uh, yeah, so Wes is just kind of chilling, which is fine, I guess. So if I were a green team here, I would 2v1 Wes. I see. Because you don't care about Sopo at 90. There's yeah. actually, like, an old... Have you... Do you, Wait, know the old you, you don't kill Popo. Yeah, yeah, I was... You, okay, you, you about to say it. You're you about to say make it. Popo watch as you 2v1 the other yeah, character. Yeah, you make him watch. Like, Maybe bear away a bunch. Yeah, like, but, especially on Dreamland, it's funny. You're, you're never going to kill him with back air on Dreamland. Right. Which is, like, kind of great. Down smash is kind of the risk, I guess. Yeah, yeah, but it's... Uh, but right. you see this, it's like they killed Popo, but like, what if they'd done 50 damage to Wes in the meantime, you know? Right. Like, that would have been way better. But, you know, I mean, they're probably comfortable just winning 1v1 until it's over, which is reasonable as double oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Never a bad strat. I think they're doing okay. Yeah, they're doing great. Um, but, like I said, pleasantly surprised to see how Wes is playing, or trying to play at least. Calibrates well for teams with Chu. Like yeah, yeah. Awesome. Have, they have teamed before, I believe. Yeah, I, Chu and Teams is wild. I don't know how he makes some of the team's combinations work. I think the biggest thing with Chu, though, is that he's just really good at doing his thing. And it's so it's like he has like a rock. He's a, like a rock for his team. Yeah. Because it's I don't think he like adapts to the other character as much as he has this thing that he's so good at that like anyone can play with. You know what I mean? I see. He's one of those players. It's like Mewtwo King's gonna do his thing. Right. But it's a pretty good thing, you know. Like. <laughs> but yeah, we're saying it's, it's hard to stop. We did watch Chu just get edge guarded without any sort of assistance at all. Yeah, things. and I mean that's what happens, right? Yeah. And now, you know, Wes is in the middle, and then, yeah, I would have liked to see the 2v1, but... Oh, Wes is kind of going in. All right. I'm thinking of some combos, but it really doesn't feel like enough versus this team. It does feel like whenever the Foxes need a break from tree, they can just go to top platform. Yeah, right? And that's and the thing, right? So, like, what do you really do about that? Oh, oh. that's the back throw. That was good. It's oh, okay, this is their this. chance. That was a good conversion. So... The only way green team loses this is if the fox at zero takes like 80 damage before the other fox dies right now. Right. So th you just have to make sure that doesn't happen. Very dead, 2v1. We did it. <laughs> now they're both going to do their favorite thing, try and beat up Wes Wells. Oh, uh, that could be both of their favorite thing, actually. They, they both yeah. really <laughs> like it. They <laughs> really, really like it. Personally. Dude, I remember like when Fiction just would tweet every tournament that he beat Wes Wells. It'd be like a bar local yeah. that nobody went to. It'd be outside, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Outside. All right, beat Wes again. And then when Wes got the one, yeah. it was relentless. Yeah, yeah. And it was always at a bigger tournament. Yeah, and a more important tournament. The one like, that Fiction had won. <laughs> But yeah, I feel like that game went roughly, you know, yeah. as we talked about. Um, I like the D pick though. I mean, yeah, it makes two strong. It does Laser strong? It's hard to avoid their shenanigans on the stage. Yeah, I agree. Um, but again, West has to be like a powerhouse here to not die. Absolutely. At any power in the world, you put the first these two foxes on empty, it's gonna be hard. Like both IBDW and Fiction are really good at killing ice climbers. I think. Yeah. But if they, they Fiction must on the stage is. There's something evil that started <laughs> oh, happening. Like, Did you see the like arm farming army on Netplay videos? No, that sounds really funny. Just, Fiction just started learning this way to four stock army where he would jump around in the corner a bunch and then wait for the ICs to approach and instantly just kill them. Kill them every time. Every time. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense to me. Uh, looks like blue team's pulling it together on this stage, though. I like what they're doing. I, I kind of feel like Double Fox has not really had control of the ground at all. But if they don't have control of the ground, I don't feel like they have much going for them. Because like you said, the yeah. platform was like their thing. <laughs> Love that team's coverage. Yeah, yeah. It seemed dangerous, but... Worked out. Oh, 
big opening for Luigi. Wes did not care that that combo was interrupted. No, no, he didn't care at all. And I really like the down throw off Smash Bros. too. It's one of my favorite Icy things. It's neat. Oh. And there's just almost nothing that, that you in any position can do about that. Yeah, and that's, the, that's what I was worried about. Like, the one weakness of an FD with this team is like, I don't know what Falcon's going to do. Like, look at him, it's just getting Man, and now Wes is in trouble. Yeah, but he's going to be in trouble the whole time. Yeah, that's true. That's the problem, right? So, like, they have to figure out how to mitigate it. And Chu, you know, I think he performs best when he's, like, kind of the stomp tank of the team. Right. But, like, that's not enough, Peter. This is pretty good team coordination for the Foxes right now. Yeah. They're getting themselves out of some scrapes and converting. Yeah, so they've been team, what, three, four times now? Yeah, yeah something like that. But they, they seem to be, you know, getting better and better. I always forget exactly how many times. But yeah. yeah. For a while, it was fiction apps and pages. Like oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That apps and page kind of yeah. disappeared. Yeah, he, he had to go away for a little bit. Got ranked really high anyway, though, yeah. right? Made yeah. a strong first half of the year. And he's, he's playing again. Oh, he is? Okay. Well, yeah. I guess people I've heard, are up to pitch hands to look forward to it. Yeah, I've heard good things from his local scene. I like that. Cool. He's from Minnesota, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, we're saying four socks to two, green team in the lead. We're saying, I still don't know which fox is which. I, should, uh, I think FFF is fiction. Is fiction. That Typically. seems really reasonable, but yeah. you know, what do I know? No, I mean, um, it'd be very easily tricking us. Yeah, but, uh, that's I mean, my guess. Fiction, stock tanking at 153 then. Just watched IBDW down tilt. Oh, okay, okay. IBDW is definitely up. the I'm a down tilt three, four or five times in another guy. This is the problem. One Fox just stopped Wes's lasers, the other one beat up on Nana. Yeah, I'm like, oh, well, I feel like that's like the third time Spike in the set. Right now. And that's going to be it? Yeah. Oh, oh, that's two out of three. I didn't even realize. It does yeah. say that. We're, we're going to be best at three probably until winners of the quarters. That makes sense. That makes I sense. I think maybe the top eight set to like qualify to quote unquote get out of this pool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And is it maybe? Okay, okay. Well, maybe the one before that I was thinking about because um, Dark Admiral Ralph. Oh, they beat SJ Shrimp, right? Oh, they might have. I uh, heard. All, I heard. All I saw was the uh, Zayn HBox set, and that went to game five. Versus who? Uh, versus Zayn HBox, Dark Admiral Ralph. Oh, okay. And okay. then Zayn HBox played another set, so we might see yeah, another round of Yeah, they played Pump M2K, I think. Yeah, right. Yeah. So maybe the round after this in winners. Okay, true. It's going to be that. True. Yeah. So Chu and West go down to losers. Yeah, and I'm sure they'll make a run. Yeah. I mean, they were actually looking pretty good, all things considered. I liked it. It's just a tough matchup. Yeah, I think it was a tough matchup. And I mean, yeah. I, I don't really... I wonder if any two people playing Falco and Ice Climbers could beat this team right now and the whole world. Like, you, you know what I mean? Do you think if Mango can just deeply outplay... Like fiction, or I—I mean, I don't know. They were together so often. Yeah, I mean, th and they have the option to be right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That's weird. It's true. Is very good at teams. Yeah, he's very good, but it's yeah. like, and it's not like Wes did bad. No. Like I think Wes performed par for the course, considering the matchup, the situation. Like, and he did things that we thought he was supposed to do. Yeah, he actually did good things, and I mean, he did good. He put out a lot of damage. But like, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's hard. It's just. Um, just the way the game goes sometimes. Yeah, but that's okay. Yeah, sure I we wonder have. who we're going to have next. Yeah, yeah um, I think that oh. has Azul and... Oh, it's Daki Bladewise. Oh, I think versus Azul and uh, Rocky. Yeah. I think it's Azul. You can take any of the NorCal, Spacey slash Berkeley and players. put them all together. Put them all together. It's a team. Like the Irvine players as well. Yeah, yeah. Kind of, some like of them. Connor, Face Roll, McCain, Psycho Midget, Kira. You, like. you can shift a lot of them around. Yeah. And Their team. Get, get a very strong team. So Rocky actually moved to San Diego recently. Oh, whoa, okay. Yeah, he's just been like grinding school. Yeah, grinding school, sense. hitting the gym. Hell yeah, that's a good way to be. Yeah, you're like, yeah, you like go. to see that. Let's go, Rocky. You an exercising man himself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Uh, but he plays Santi, you know, as much as anybody plays Santi. Yeah, that's fair. You know, so he's um, got some practice. 